as I mentioned in the other video, we recently purchased an Omnia 1 multicast to replace that Omnia 6 and put that as a spare for our actual FM since uh, the multicast option doesn't do uh, composite as well when it's in multicast mode when it's in FM mode it does a composite output as well with a uh, final clipper in uh, multicast mode it also does a final limiter as well so they're cool options so uh, as the same way with the 6 you just have the single knob and uh, the knob you press in to select you have your uh, a selectable input or output bar graph as well as your uh, composite output or aux which is an active in the multicast mode but uh, there's your headphone monitoring output and uh, if you hold down the knob it'll go between the menu and that cool little bar graph setup so here you can see we have a uh, four band AGC with a wide band at the beginning we'll then go over into our uh, four band limiter as well as a uh, bass clipper uh, and the final limiter over there. And the census there actually, I forgot to mention the census. It's also a really cool feature. It'll pre process the audio for lossy audio compression. So here we have processing input out with administrative and lock front panel. Uh, processing, uh, you can adjust the processing, save or preset, and do all sorts of stuff like that. You do your pre processing as well as the other stuff. I'm not showing the internals of these menus because I don't want to reveal the settings that we're using for specific tasks. So input output, you know, and this is where you can select your meter. You can see now that's the AES input reason on this. Analog output, AES output, and live wire output. And now live wire is disabled since we uh, don't want to flood the network to my computer that's just behind the unit uh, with packets. But uh, you can also select your output, your input and output. Your input, you can select AES analog, failover, same as the other unit, and your modes. Uh, output, you can select your output levels, all independent of each other. Uh, and then you have your live wire settings where you disable or enable live wire. Well, enabling live wire, you'd have to do through the web interface. Uh, and then you have your other settings here, like uh, about page, network. What's cool, you got a contrast uh, adjustment there as well. Reboot security where you change or enable or disable the password. So, that's the Omnia 1 multicast. Another one of our audio processors. Actually, somewhat of an exclusive Omnia kind of person. I'm not really big on the Orban stuff. It's more so, I guess, a personal preference or really, I think the Omnia stuff is a lot better built. More time is spent into it and Hopefully eventually get an Omni 11 here, I think. But yes, thanks for watching. That's the Omnia 1 multicast.